Dear colleagues, we are very grateful for the aid we continue to receive both large organized deliveries of equipment and medicines, and also privately sent medicine, heating supplies and first aid kits. Here, there are two logistical ways to deliver humanitarian aid. The direct way, that is from the donor to the final consumer, the hospital or military unit. For example, today we received a large load from the Magdeburg clinics through the organization AWO, worth 200,000 euro for 25 clinics of National Academy of Medical Science of Ukraine. Another way is not large amount collected privately, is delivered by small vehicles. Now, we need three main things. The first is medicine that cannot be obtained by individuals, mostly expensive, immunosuppressive, chemotherapy, opioids, dialysis supplies. Second, we need expensive equipment that we do not have, namely operating tools, operating stand-alone lights, field operating tablets, devices for monitoring the patient's condition, etc. Third, assistance with conducting TCCC trainings for instructors who will be able to teach the civilians emergency assistance. And the last is assistance to refugees from Ukraine who are brought now in their medical care. We also ask, very important, you to influence Russian and Belarusian doctors and medical professionals to decide to on their position, on their political leaders. Otherwise, we ask you to exclude their associations from yours. We see this as a direct sanction against Russian and Belarusian doctors. Thank you very much for your support.